Hello everyone, welcome back to Prison Architect. Um, so last time we uh, installed a lot of safety in our prison, and there has there have been a couple of updates since that since I've recorded that video, and I uh, well I've pre-recorded those quite a while ago, and uh, there have been some updates. So I don't know exactly what has been changed but what definitely has been changed is the way I feel about this whole planning so I think what I want to do is wait give me a second this down here Wait, I'm, I'm gonna draw the, the lines now and explain a little bit later. So this, this whole sh this section down here should be the yard and uh, that means that, oh wait, how tall is this? That is 25 meters and then here we have Okay, so that goes to here. This, actually I might not delete these walls here. This might be like our security room or something. Um, so this down here is the yard. Why, why is this going to be the yard? Because when prisoners try to escape and well if I, if I'd made this into a cell block then they could just dig out tunnels to either side and uh, just basically say goodbye and escape without problem however if this is the yard then uh, either they have to dig tunnels through the yard all the way across or you know they, they'd have to break the fences or anything like that and that is a little bit less likely and therefore I decided that this would be the yard. Um, in any case, in the middle we would have the canteen and kitchen. I think I would make this a little bit wider too. But Let's leave it for now. I mean, I don't have money to build all those foundations yet anyway. So let's see what's going on. It's sleeping time, so that's the least exciting time right now. We get 12,600. An intake of eight prisoners tomorrow. Oh, that's, that's awesome. These new functions are definitely uh, these functions are definitely new, and fill capacity is exactly what what I want right now for the prisoner intake. Requires entrance, yes, but I don't I I don't want to build an entrance for this yet because I don't have anything to put in there. So we did detected another tunnel, which is fine. It's great that we saw it. Um, there is a shower. And there is the other shower. Um, what else? What time is it? Showering and eating time.
I don't I still don't know exactly what's going on in the forestry. Well we're basically planting trees and then chopping it down and using the wood in our workshop or something like that. I have no idea. Speaking of wood in our uh, workshop, we still got some stacks to sell. That was just visitors. <laughs> there was a death in the shower. Of all places to fight, why the shower? And what are they complaining about even? A lot of stuff actually. Exercise, family, recreation, freedom. Well, freedom is... Freedom is a tough one. Because... I'm actually gonna go with... Replacing this with a more free time, I guess. This should, this should, um, actually, this should satisfy our need for freedom. And in the long run, not immediately. Oh, we made a lot of money with the prisoner releases. That's awesome. And the fact, and the fact that this also automatically adjusts itself is also awesome we got 80 guards right now and they are apparently very necessary so let's see how much does the does this foundation cost where do we start here down to here. That's about 50 grand. Wait, what? Why is the workshop red? There's a madman with a, with a drill. Somebody please handle that situation. You right here. Wait, what? The drill is, strong, is stronger than this guy's shotgun? There we go. He's unconscious now. Man. So apparently the... The updates have made the game a lot more spicy, you know, a lot more, a lot more uh, stuff happening. I'm not sure if I like that though. Not 
level 3000 for an early release. Yeah, take 11 tomorrow. That's gonna be enough to build a foundation. It's gonna leave us with, with basically no cash though. And I'm not sure if that's the best idea. Let's look at our programs. So the programs just like 10,000 per hour hearings every day and that's good. Spiritual guidance has been finished 864 times. <laughs> that's just ridiculous. Um, well General education qualification, nobody is qualified and interested in this. So, well, what we really need is more prisoners. And what we need for more prisoners is more space. Which is why I'm holding on to this foundation right here. Wait, how much is the upper one? I think that's more expensive than the one we looked at before. Yeah, it must be. Actually, no, it isn't. 40,680. Don't want to build that one yet. Because what, what, what use do I get out of this long corridor right now? None, but in the end, it's, it doesn't really matter anyway, because if I'm only going to use all the space once all the foundations are, are built. Then it doesn't really matter which one I build first, which one I build last, right? But here you go, here you go, workman. You get some. Wait, what? Excuse me? Can I only build it this way? Yeah, that's... that's... It seems like that's how it works right now. Good. Now my workmen have something to do. I'm gonna take I'm gonna take in thirteen more prisoners tomorrow, and that's gonna be some more decent cash. Hopefully we can release a couple of prisoners until then. No, but that that's over. The last um, session of parole hearings end at six p.m. I think. Yeah, how many, how many workmen do I have now? Is that 40? 40 workmen? Why do I have 40 of them? <laughs> I, mean, I know I must have hired so many, but well, all right. <laughs> I mean, there's nothing wrong with having a lot of workmen. It's just that, you know, in the long run, they're kind of expensive. 
when they're not constantly doing something. But usually they are because they're not only there for building and repairing and stuff, they're also handling, you know, the forestry, they're handling, I don't know, bringing the, ingredi the ingredients for the kitchen from, from outside or something like that. They're also here for, you know, handling the trash and everything. So yeah, it's, it's very useful. And the foundation is already almost built. Much so one one square of fence costs three dollars. And considering that the fence is gonna be like, yeah, I'm I'm gonna build all the fences already because they're very cheap, and we're gonna go on up until here and until here. How are they gonna get out? Well, just walk this way. This now cost how much? A hundred and sixty thousand. Well, <laughs> this new plot of land would be enormous, though. It would be four hundred by eighty meters. <laughs> that's a lot. It's that's that's a ton of space. That is. Same on this side. On this side we would have 100 by 160, which is 80,000. Let's see, valuation is 800, so it would be 900,000 without the deaths. And I think if we'd actually build an entrance to this area, the, the valuation would go up because I think it only counts when the building is complete and accessible. But I don't want to do that yet. So the workmen are almost done with the, with the fences as well. Now they're finished. And what's up next um we will actually i do have enough money for this foundation no i don't i don't let's see what do our prisoners want more hygiene that's why we got the janitors so this will go down um exercise we got like 20 weight benches here, another 8 here, we got 21 there, we get some in the common room, so there's, there's basically enough for everyone. Just, if you're gonna complain about exercise, just go ahead and use those weight benches, man. Not only complain about, you know, your body shape not being where you want it to be, just do something about it then. daily cash flow is decreasing actually which is a little bit worrying because we have um, where is it 
tax relief and offshore tax haven. So our so our um, daily cash flow is as high as it's gonna get right now. It could not be higher. Also, what am I gonna do with this space down here? Let's see. I could make... Well, what would make sense? Let's look at the rooms we, we got right now. There's a visitation room. There's a big visitation room, so I don't think we need an, another one of those. We got plenty of solitaries here, here, he, here, and here. So that is also something we don't need. We get a main room, we get a library, we get two big showers. I don't think we need another canteen. We might want a second kitchen. But that's kind of far away from the canteen, isn't it? Um, we certainly don't need another office, because nobody is visiting the psychologist's office anyway. And uh, that is the prowl hearing. That is a workshop. I I don't. I honestly don't know what we're gonna use this space for. Maybe we'll just leave it. So we got eight thousand on the bank now. Um, prisoners are going to be arriving at 8 a.m., right? Yeah. One prisoner is due, due for relief soon, and 13 prisoners are up for parole. We have 10 parole rooms, so that is totally fine. The big thing that is no longer showing up at any point is that, is, you know, um, prisoners uh, due for solitary, up for solitary confinement, I should say, because now we have so many solitaries that you know basically we can take, we can even handle it if almost every single person in our prison is up for solitary confinement, which would be a terrible time, but you know, life goes on. So, our intake is going to be 13 prisoners. And that's going to give us another 5,500. And with that, I think we're going to build this small foundation here. Actually, now we can take in 14, which is even better. Oh, it, no, it, it was going to give us 6,500, now it's going to give us 7,000. Apparently we planted another tree. One more death. In the parole room? He killed the parole lawyer. What a dick. That, that man was the, was the man that was going to release you. So I gotta put it like this, right? I can also put it like that and then put the other one like this. Alrighty. Oh, I'm an idiot. Like, once I once I built the foundations, the the lines for the plannings are gone, and therefore I will not 
I will not be able to tell which, like, what would be what after everything is done. However, can I set some more of these now? I can. Okay, that's that's fine. It's fine then. Another death? Where? Another another brawl lawyer? Really? No, this time my prisoner died because we Oh and we released uh, we released three more. Awesome. That's an that's a nice stack of cash right there. Oh, we shouldn't have built that yet. Now I'm gonna have to build this in two parts. From here to here and then from there to there. Eighteen thousand, what do we what do we do with that? Can we build this yet? I don't think so. No. Actually we're closer than I thought we would be to making this work. Or maybe it's best if I just build all the foundations first and then actually kind of try and restructure what I want what I want how I want everything to look and to be you know plan out that would also not be the worst idea I think got some more cash flow some more shop intake The two cashiers are are be, are gonna be searched. They might have stolen something, you know. Well, if you're working behind the counter in the shop, then of course, like you're always suspect to stealing. So we need a thousand more, which is going to be no problem if we can actually get one more uh, early release. Let's see, the regime is, we're at eating time and uh, then it's going to be free time. What are the needs? Um, food, well it's gonna be, it is eating time so that should be taken care of, hygiene, exercise, family, recreation. You can have as much exercise and recreation as you want in your common room. There's even some TVs in there. And exercise as well, there's some weight benches here, 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 like, just do it. <laughs> There's everything and there's everything there. There we go. There go the early releases and that means we can build this. Danger level is decreasing, which is good. Only one prisoner say, says they're well treated. Excuse me? 137 prisoners have serious complaints about what? 
well stuff that's currently going on anyway like hygiene exercise family recreation we're doing things to to kind of satisfy their needs there now it's decreasing rapidly 365 prisoners have been calmed recently I don't I don't even have this that many but the, I guess it it also counts the ones that have been uh, have been released already the ones that have died <laughs> they've been they've been calmed before before the storm really <laughs> you could say they've been calmed before they they died so they Maybe they died. Uh, uh, maybe they died happy. I don't know. Maybe they didn't. It's also a pretty kind of questionable thing to say in general. <laughs> maybe they died happy. So exercise is going on right now. Recreation is going on. Yeah, I think the new regime with a lot more free time will definitely um, affect those things positively. Yeah, now they have time for for exercise, for family, for recreation, for everything. So this foundation is processing really quickly as well. Doesn't take very much longer until it's finished. Actually, is it? Fi it looks finished to me, but there's still, you know, breaking concrete lying around. So I'm not sure if it actually is finished. So we've we've done a lot of building in this episode and i think i'm gonna call it right here hope you guys enjoyed leave a like or a comment if you did thank you for watching i will see you next time